All right, here we are at the property on Moore Lane. I forgot my camera, so I have to use my phone to shoot the video. Outside doesn't seem to be in bad shape. I think a water line froze and broke inside. Uh, and there's a lot of water damage on the inside. Yeah, the roof looks fine, the siding looks fine. Windows are all okay for a rental. It's got a big yard, not fenced in on one side. Unless you want to count that as a fence. Air conditioner's still there. I wouldn't expect that to be though. The furnace still look good inside too. There's a garage. To just use that for storage. <clears throat> Let's go look at this garage and make sure it's not going to fall down. Looks like they put some support up here at some point already. I'll go push on it, and see if it falls over. Yeah, it's not moving. Seems like a decent enough area. It's real close to the Mamika property. Mamika is just on the other side of those tracks over there. All right, so first thing you do is smell a bunch of mold. That's because the water line broke. All the walls still seem to be fine. The flooring, on the other hand, is not fine. I would probably go ahead and replace all this kitchen. Maybe keep the appliances, but why would yeah, maybe not. A little room there. There's your bathroom. Most there's laundry in there. I think the laundry's in the basement. It's a bedroom. Another bedroom. Hmm. <sighs> a little outlet caught fire there. 
That's illegally wired. That's how they used to do it back in the day, though. Huh. I have an electrician look at that. I'd probably replace that vanity. Let's go see the basement. I think that's drywall. That all needs to come out. We don't need to have this drywalled. There's your laundry. Furnace and water heater. Water heater shot. It's hard to tell about the furnace. I mean, from this angle, it doesn't look too bad, but that doesn't mean anything. All right, let me get out of here so I can breathe again. That's it for Moline. I'll give you the numbers later. Thanks, bye.